Hey, what's going on NVIDIA users? A good news for all of you guys. The all new, brand new NVIDIA app is now out and you can download it from the web and it has got tons of new things which we are going to cover in this video. So make sure to watch it till the end and without wasting any more time, let's drop straight into optimizing the all new NVIDIA app. All right, first things first, if you have not yet downloaded the application, go to the link in the description below and you'll be on the NVIDIA's official website. You'll find the NVIDIA app beta right over here. You can simply click on download beta and install it on your PC. Once you've installed it, simply open it up and now you'll be on a page like this. It will ask you to select your preferred driver and it has game ready drivers for gamers and studio ready drivers for creators. Now, once again, I am a gamer, so I need to select the game ready drivers, hit next, then it will ask you to optimize games and creative applications. You have to simply turn this thing off, leave it as it is because you'll set everything manually, then simply go to next. Next, it will ask you to enable the Nvidia overlay. This is really important. It's new. This is new, so you have to turn this thing on and I'm going to be showing you guys what it does later. Once it is done, simply go to next. It will show you redeem exclusive rewards, skip to app and now you will be on the home page of your application. Now over here, you'll see the games that you've installed on your PC as well as some news articles from Nvidia. In the second page, you'll go to drivers in which you can see if you have your latest drivers up and running or not. If not, you can simply install the latest drivers and it will help you with the game. Next is the graphics part in which you'll find your installed applications. After that, you'll find redeem, redeem rewards. And lastly is the settings gear. Now go back to graphics and you'll find all of the installed games and applications right on this screen. You can change individual settings for each application right over here. But what we are concerned for this video is going to be the global settings. Simply click on global settings and now you'll be on this page. First thing you have to do is enable RTX dynamic vibrance. This is a really new feature and it's really awesome. Battery boost is gonna be for laptop users, image sharpening, keep it off, low latency mode, keep it ultra, max frame rate, simply enable this and put it to 1000, power management mode, select prefer maximum performance and shader cache should be 5 GB. Vertical sync should be turned off and then you'll find virtual reality and whisper mode, simply disable both of them. Once it is done, simply minimize your application. Well, before moving ahead, I would like to introduce you all to GVG Mall, a store which fulfills all your digital needs for games and gift cards in one place. GVG Mall has a wide variety of digital keys for games and in-game currency for multiple vendors, which is legit, reliable, and convenient. On the website, you can find a lot of categories where you can get Steam and Origin, as well as PC game gift cards and genuine Windows activation key. I, however, liked how convenient it is to get a genuine Windows key since I do not like the activate Windows watermark on my screen and to fix it, I can literally get a Windows key for a huge discount. Generally, you can get Windows 10 for $53.78, but on this sale, you can get it for $21.75. And if you use my code FOX25, you can get additional 25% off at just $16.31. And you also have Windows 11 update for free. And it is perfect time to get rid of that Windows activation mark. There are multi bit payment methods which are convenient and once you buy it, you will get an email within minutes and using that code, you can activate your windows in no time. So go check out GVG Mall, links are in the description below. Now we have the most important part that is the in-game overlay. Once you are over here by pressing Alt and Z together, it will ask you to record and it has a ton of options right over here. But the most important part is the settings gear in which you'll find video capture. Simply open this thing up and in here you can set the instant replay length. I have set this thing to 5 minutes. Quality is custom. Resolution is in game and the frame rate limit. This time it goes up to 120 FPS. This is super insane. I think that 120 FPS for an instant replay gives you a lot of things to play with, especially if you are recording some montages. The super slow motion is gonna be a real good effect with this. But once again, this is the best part of the NVIDIA application is that you don't have to sign in to get your drivers updated or change the settings. However, most of the settings are still only be changeable by the normal control panel. So you have to download it in any case. However, this one is really good, so I highly suggest you guys to use it. 
All right, next step is creating a restore point. And this is really important. Simply search for create a restore point on your PC. Then over here, look for a local disk C, click on create and name it NVIDIA. Just so you remember it. I highly recommend you guys now to skip this step because it is really essential in saving your system if you want to restore every setting back without any data loss. Last and most important feature is the NVIDIA app optimization pack. I'll be leaving a link to this down in the description below. It is a super important and super easy to use. First thing is the increased power efficiency registry. You have to simply double click to run it and it will improve the power consumption on your PC. Second is the MSI mode utility. You have to run this as administrator and it will open up this simple program right in front of you. Now you have to look for your GPU right over here. Simply click on the MSI button and from undefined set this thing to high and apply. This will set your GPU affinity to the higher level and it will utilize your GPU for the maximum performance. Last is the ultimate performance power plan. You have to open this text file. And once you're here, simply copy this string, open up CMD and run this as administrator. Now, all you have to do is paste this command right over here. I have already done it and press enter. Then you have to open up control panel on your PC, search for power options right over here. And then once you're here, you have to select ultimate performance from this list and it will give you the best performance possible for your PC. Once that is done, simply close this program and you're good to go. So guys, that was it for this video. I hope I could have helped you out. If I could have make sure to do leave like and smash it subscribe button do leave your thoughts about the new nvidia app in the comments below and let me know if there are anything else that i can cover on this application we'll see you guys in another amazing video until then stay tuned keep watching bear fox and peace out